can I still sound funny? And I have yeah. for a few weeks. Um, and as you know, it was, it's been a huge amount of stress. Mm -hmm. Um, so, but I've been trying to nebulize and so I don't know if I'm just putting in the wrong stuff or whatever, you know, cause I'm not that scientific about it. I just kind of, this stuff's good. I'm going to put it in there. And it seems to make me a little bit worse when I do it, which I know isn't right. <laughs> so, um, define worse. Like I got more, I coughed more okay. and, um, got more horse too. Okay. Now I'm not getting as hoarse now. I can keep my voice all day long at this level, but, um, yeah. So I don't know. And I was doing it like I would do it three to four times a day, but, um, you know, then I backed off because I just didn't know if I was doing it wrong. <laughs> so. Yeah, there's a lot of variables there, right. um, depending on what you're putting in and how much of each thing you're putting in. Uh, so right. if you're, if you're quote, just putting it in there, um, maybe it was too much of like, hey, maybe there's too much hydrogen peroxide, which is burning, you know, I more. didn't have that because you okay. guys talked about the burning. So okay. I made sure, like, I could kind of measure it on that mm -hmm. nebulizer cup. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, but like with this, so, and then I did the H2O2, the saline. And then I just did like a drop or two of the silver and astragalus and iodine. So. Okay. Um, so either something was irritating that or the increased cough was what you were doing was working. Right. Right. I so you're, you're, yeah. you're moving things out faster, more efficiently. Um, yeah. So if you're doing that and you're getting better and holding your voice longer than that, appears to be what was happening if you were doing that and you leave and like you're taking a step back then then maybe it's irritating you right, right. so you'd have to say uh which of those was it 